Hi guys, today is a recipe that I promised some time ago to my dear Carla who has been asking for uh, a recipe to preserve something for um, winter or <laughs> for the season when uh, the fresh produce is not available. I told her that we didn't have um, that many things from the garden that I could use uh, for this purpose but I will share something with the red cabbage soon but until then I want to share a recipe for some delicious um, pickled I think <laughs> preserved roasted red peppers. These are not from our garden, but they are still really delicious. You want to start by prepping the red peppers. So first you want to wash them well, then half them and remove the seeds. Then you want to slice them and add them onto a baking tray covered with some parchment paper. Drizzle over some salt, this is optional as we are adding the salt later on. And then you want to roast them until they are nice and soft and charred. Then remove them from the oven and while they are still really hot, you want to remove them into a bowl and cover that bowl with aluminium foil. Leave aside for about 30 minutes and then it will be really easy for you to peel the skins off. Once you've peeled off the skins, you want to leave the red peppers aside to cool completely. You can even allow them cool overnight. Once cool, you want to season with salt and add in the rosemary. You can also leave this out, so it's optional. You can use rosemary or leave it out. And then you also want to season with some black pepper. Then we are going to prepare the liquid. So you want to mix 100 milliliters of 5% acidity vinegar with 200 milliliters of olive oil. You want to measure them, then whisk them so that they are all combined and then pour over the peppers. Now, this is the best way, in my opinion, to get the spices all over the red peppers and also make sure all peppers are covered with the marinade. So just get your hands in there and start mixing. And once you feel like it's all mixed through, then just make sure that the peppers are well covered or well under olive oil and vinegar, cover with some cling film and refrigerate overnight. This is again something that you want to do only if you are using rosemary. So we are infusing that rosemary flavor into the roasted peppers overnight. Then on the next day, you want to transfer the red peppers into clean sterilized glass jars. Also, you want to make sure that you don't get any rosemary in there. Then you want to strain the rest of the liquid and pour it over so that the peppers are well covered with the oil and vinegar mix. Then you also want to let out any air bubbles before you close the jar. 
So I'm letting out the air bubbles first, then just making sure that the peppers are well covered with the oil and vinegar mix and only then closing my jars. For the detailed information on how to store and how long to store these canned pickled roasted red peppers can be found over on my website along with some serving suggestions. So it's a very very simple recipe it does take a little bit time but all of the time is the waiting time so you roast the red peppers and then you just marinate them first overnight and after that or marinate you allow them to sit in the spices overnight if you're using the rosemary if you're not using rosemary don't worry about it then you can uh, jar it right away very important thing make sure you are using five percent vinegar not more and not less for the best results and then you can enjoy these red peppers with your breakfast so with some scrambled eggs some bacon or on some delicious bread you could also serve this as a side so instead of uh, serving salads you could serve some different kind of pickled vegetables along with your Thanksgiving or Christmas or any other Sunday dinner. If you enjoyed this recipe, don't forget that thumbs up for support and subscribe so you don't miss any of the coming recipes. Thank you for watching my video. Bye bye until next time.